Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm tackling my boys' closet. Um, I want to paint the dresser and also paint the shelf as well as the walls. Um, they've never, I think we, well yeah, we painted the walls when we moved in but we didn't do anything to the shelf or anything and I'm really tired of the yellow so I am just going to give that um, some paint and also paint the trim down on the bottom and just kind of give it a little bit of a makeover. So I figured I would just take you guys along and show you what I'm doing. Okay, what I'm doing now is just taking off the handles of each of the drawers so that I can paint it. Um, this dresser we had picked up before my oldest was born at a yard sale. It was like $5, I think. And I just have some charcoal paint here that I'm just gonna use. So before I started painting, I grabbed a piece of sandpaper and gave it a good sanding just to kind of uh, smooth things out and prepare the surface to help the paint stick a little bit better. The paint I'm using is some leftover I had that we used in our dining room a couple years ago. It is by Bear from Home Depot and I think the color is called Iron Mountain if anyone wants to know. And I like to use a foam roller to um, paint cabinets and stuff because I feel like it just really does a lot better job of getting it smooth and it's also smaller you can get into the corners a little bit easier but I also use a little brush to to get the places where the roller doesn't work as well and I think I ended up giving the cabinet about two coats some of it maybe a little bit more Okay guys, hello! It is day two of trying to do the closet in the boys' room. I managed to um, get the dresser done yesterday. I just painted it um, gray and I did the drawers as well. Now I need to go tackle the closet itself. I need to be painting it. Right now it's this yellow color as I mentioned before um, and I ended up just spray painting these brackets just to help it look a little better and then I'm gonna paint the shelf white along with the walls I'm gonna um, mix up some kind of gray I have some different grays here little sample bottles and also a charcoal that's left over from the dresser that I'm just gonna um, dilute with some white or something and come up with some kind of gray to put in there I didn't really want to buy paint just for the closet and I yeah, didn't have any to match the room anymore, but, but I did have to go buy some white paint this morning. I was gonna, I needed to paint the trim. I do have a couple other things that I need to paint as well, and he said that the, the gallon paint was cheaper than actually the quart container, which is probably true. So I ended up just getting a whole gallon, so I might be painting some more things. But anyways, this is what I need to do. I have the boys watching iPad. <laughs> They didn't do very much of that yesterday, and I figured, well, I'm kind of on a little limited time frame here because it's their room obviously and they need to sleep in it this afternoon so I need to really get some things done here this morning so let's get going not sure what's going on but he just wants to lay here in bed <laughs> I have one coat on the shelf. I'm probably gonna need to do several because I forgot also that I should have used some Kills primer or like a, a Zinser primer or something because of the wood. It's gonna bleed through quite a bit, but I'll do what I can. What that? What that, Mom? Just some paint. What? The little blue brush I'm using there is my favorite brush to trim with. Um, you can buy them pretty much anywhere you buy paint stuff, but the handle is flexible and it's just awesome to trim with. I really, really like it. Okay, I think I'm pretty much done painting. 
in the closet. I still have to touch up a little bit here and there, but it took a little while to get the trimming and everything done. Kind of complicated if you can't really take out the shelf, but I got it done before nap time. And now I am going to get my stuff moved back into the closet, I think. I have to vacuum a little bit and then move the dresser back over and start moving things in. <laughs> And here's the finished product. Woohoo! I'm done. Oh, it seemed like I might not get done because the boys were kind of, or Jackson rather, <laughs> was being a little bit clingy and yeah, but I did get it done now and I'm really happy with the, the end product. So I really hope you guys enjoyed the video and be on the lookout for another video um, concerning the organization in their closet. I figured I'd just do it on a separate one because I was afraid it's gonna get too long if I you know, had this whole thing plus that. So be on the lookout, probably we'll be posting that next or maybe something else in between. But if you're curious to see the organization, just uh, stick around and subscribe for more videos and I will be seeing you next time. Bye.